Welcome back guys to Bon Appetit with Miss Bree. Last week we made apple cookies. I hope you guys enjoyed them with your friends and family. I know mine did. Today I have another special treat for you guys today. Today we are going to make tacos. But not just any taco. We're going to make a special taco. A taco with cookies. Our shells are going to be made out of sugar cookies. And we're going to fill them with nice fresh fruit. And to top off our fresh fruit, you can use yogurt if you like. But me, I like a nice cheese cream filling. So, let's get started. But before we do, who remembers what we're supposed to do first? That's right. Wash our hands. So let's get our hands all nice and clean. Washing your hands is very important because it helps get off all of the germs. Very good, guys. Germs. We want to make sure we get all those germs off of our hands. We want to get in between our fingers, the palm of our hand. Don't forget about those thumbs. And under your nail. Even singing the ABCs helps. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. All right, guys, let me see those hands. Mmm, good job. They look clean to me. All right, guys, now that our hands are nice and clean, let's get started. Here I have some pre-cut cookies that I bought at your local grocery store. You are just going to place them on our pan here. You want to separate them and have them about two inches apart or so. You're gonna need a parent or guardian to help you with this because you're gonna to need to preheat your oven about 350. As these are in the oven, we are going to cut up our fresh fruit that we have here and we're going to add it into a bigger bowl because then we're going to mix it all together. And here we have our topping. I have a cream cheese. Like I said, you can do a yogurt or any type of drizzling dip that you would like to add on top. All right, in the oven it goes. All right, guys, now that our cookies are in the oven, you only need them in there for about 10 to 12 minutes. We are going to start cutting up our fruit while they're baking. I'll start with my apples. You only need to slice them up pretty small because they're going to go inside of your cookie shell. So you don't want them to be really, really big, big chunks. So slicing them pretty thin should work. With the grapes, you can slice them in half and then slice them in half again. So basically, you want to have four little slices for your grapes. When it comes to cutting, remember, you always want to get a parent or guardian to help you out. Cutting off the strawberry, you just want to cut the tip, just like that, and then you can slice it. Remember, watch your hands. So if you wanna leave them sliced like that and slide them inside of your shell, you can. Or if you're like me, I like mine's cut up into smaller pieces, like so. And after you're done cutting up all of your fruit, that's what our extra bowl is for. All right, you guys. Now that you have your fruit all nice and cut up and everything, just how you like it, you can go ahead and you can add a little sugar in there if you would like to make it a little sweeter or add some honey. I like to add a little honey in mine for a little sweet taste. Okay, now that we have our cookies out of the oven, let me show you what our next step is. You wanna make sure your cookies are still really, really soft because you want to add them onto a pin roll for, or with parchment paper and you want them to still be a little soft so you can make them into the shape of a taco. You can use a smaller pin roll if you would like. The smaller the better, because it gives it that more of a form of a taco. And you wanna just lay them across just like that. 
So as they start to cool off, they will be in a taco shape. All right guys, now that our cookies are nice and cooled down, they should be in a nice little shape of a taco. So you're gonna take your spoon and you're gonna scoop up a nice, nice little amount of your fresh fruit that you cut up earlier and add it into your taco, like that. Then you're gonna take that nice topping that you chose and you're gonna add it on the top just like that. And there you have it guys, your cookie taco. I hope you guys enjoy. Mm -mm -mm. Delicious. Good. All right you guys, and that's all we have for today on Bon Appetit with Miss Bree. I hope you guys enjoy your sugar cookie tacos and let me know how they taste. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell. All right, bye you guys. See you at the next one.